what is the difference between the find and the filter methods in array very important question here is the list of get methods that are used to get elements from the array okay find filter and slice method let's check out the differences between the find and filter method first suppose we have an array as a variable that contains a list of numbers assigned to it now the use of the find method is find method gets the first element that satisfies a condition condition let me show you how here you can see that the find method will accept all the elements of the array one by one in this num parameter by using the arrow function so that is arrow function arrow function are like normal functions only and they do accept parameters like normal function then inside the find method there will be this condition like this and the find function will return the first element of the array remember uh, 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 listen carefully the first element of the array for which this condition is true in this case for element 2 this 2 percentile 2 will be equal to, to 0 right because if you divide 2 by 2 then uh, the remainder will be equal to 0 therefore 2 will be the result element of the find function which will be stored in the variable c then now this condition is also true for this next four element also but remember with the find function you only get the first element that satisfies the condition great this is find then we have the filter function of the javascript this is used very very frequently in many application and it is very very important suppose you have the same array uh, 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 this now the use of the filter function is the filter function gets an array of an uh, of elements from an array that satisfies the condition so basically the find function will find the just the first element but the filter function will get all the elements that satisfies the condition see the code and here the logic is exactly the same as find function all the elements of the array will be accepted as a pair as the parameters one by one and inside there will be a condition now the difference is that for whatever element this condition is true all those elements will be added to the result array and that array will be finally assigned to this variable d got it so this time you will get two and four in the result array because both elements satisfies the condition remember the result will be an array this time with the filter method not a single element okay so that is the difference between them all right the way i explained it i think this difference will remain in your mind forever